for more Bollywood gossip, hit the bell icon and never miss a video. This picture of Salman and Sohail from the upcoming Eid release Tube Light is so striking. Yes, for all those who thought that Salman's Tube Light pictures are over in the media, well, here it is for you to enjoy. Sohail and Salman on a bicycle. How cute can that get? And Salman seemingly loving the entire thing. Salman, as we told you, would be shown as a very slow learner who conquers it all finally. He would be the epitome of winning a challenge and this is where perhaps the term tube light has come in. Well, his co-star would be Susu and we are sure that the film would surely cross its predicted 400 crores. Well, we are all keen to watch the movie and with such pictures seeping into our imaginations, we can only say that we are eager to see more from the film. What do you say about this picture of Sohail and Salman? Do let us know. Salman Khan and Ulya were seen together in Udaipur. <laughs> so what was the couple doing there? Well, before your imagination runs riot, let us tell you that we guess Salman was there for the marriage of Nepali businessman Binod Chaudhary's son, Varun, which took place at Jag Mantir. The bride Anushri is the daughter of jeweler Rajkumar Tongkia. Well, with rumours of Salman and Ulya having a tiff before the Dabang tour and her not participating in the tour, and this is something Sarah Hadke, Hena. Ulya and Salman are a cute couple and we dig their bonding. However, with so much happening, we wonder where else would they be now seen together. The two make a great pair and fans of Salman are more than happy to see them close to each other. However, rumours were rife that it is all over between them. But this picture surely sets up pulse racing again. What say? Do let us know how you feel about Ulya and Salman together. Not at all, not at all. There is no problem in our reach. And actually, uh, one person who is very instrumental in my training is Salman Bhai. And there is no <laughs> problem in our reach. So बहुत जल्दी बहुत जल्दी जी आई थिंक जैसे ही मेरे पास कुछ खबर होगी सर्वेल के अनाउंसमेंट हो जाएगी सुरक्षित है बहुत जल्दी आपको बता देंगे सर थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू जो हाल में आपके अगर मैं बात करूं या आपकी सोच की बात करूं या जितना प्रेम सुने लोग आपको देते हैं वो हमने तो शायद सलमान शाहरुख के लिए भी नहीं देखा और सबसे अहम बात मैं कहना चाहूँगा कि एक आर्टिस्ट हैं आप बाबा तो हैं ही हम सब जानते हैं लेकिन एक आर्टिस्ट भी आपके अंदर हैं और हम सबको नजर आता है जिस तरह के हालात मुंबई में हैं हाल में सोनू निगम साहब ने एक बयान दिया किसी प्रार्थना को लेकर उस पर ऐतराज जताया और पूरे फिल्म इंडस्ट्री दो तबकों में बट गई और आपसे जब हम मिलते हैं तो सब धर्म एक समान और एक की आप बात करते हैं ये जो हुआ मसला उस पे आप क्या कहना चाहेंगे आ, वैसे आ, तब हम शूट कर रहे थे और हमें ये बताया गया था कि ऐसा कुछ उन्होंने बोला है कि शोर मचता है या ऐसा नहीं करना चाहिए हमें नहीं लगता कि हम किसी धर्म पे नुकता चीनी करें जब तक कि हम उस धर्म की गहराई तक नहीं जाते क्योंकि हमने हर धर्म को रिसर्च किया है हर धर्म को पढ़ा है पढ़ा ही नहीं रिसर्च किया है हर धर्म पे तो हमें पता है कि धर्म में जो चीजें कही गई है वो अगर कोई शराब पी के गाड़ियां देता है तो क्या वो सही है या कोई आ, किसी से लड़ाई झगड़ा करता है क्या वो सही है उनको कोई उनको रोकना तो सही है लेकिन धर्म पे नुकता चीनी हमें नहीं लगता किसी को करनी चाहिए तब तक जब तक कि पूर्णतः उसको जानता नहीं आ, फिर बाद में चक्कर पड़ जाता है कि आप उसका जवाब नहीं दे पाते कि आपने ऐसा क्यों कहा तो हमें नहीं लगता कि ऐसा करना चाहिए some time back, we had reported that sister Arpita was miffed at Salman Khan for not launching her husband Ayush in Bollywood. But now it seems that Salman has set the platform just right and is helping Ayush get his launch back to Bollywood.
Recently, we spotted Ayush outside the Dharma Productions office where he had some serious talks with Karan Johar about his launch. Going by the rumors, Salman too was present and things are finally in place. An elated Arpita took to Twitter to confirm the news. The film, which will have Ayush as the solo lead, will be on floors by July. Meanwhile, Sallu and Kejo have also lined up another big venture with the Khilari Akshay Kumar. While we await more details of this exciting news, let us know if you are keen to see how Ayush's debut project shapes up. SS Raja Molly's Bahubali is breaking all records as expected. Add to the charisma and luck of the film is the fact that it is an extended weekend. The film has already earned more than 300 crore worldwide in the first two days and now as per the early estimates, the film is easily sachet with a gross collection of 415 crores in the domestic markets itself. Trade analyst Ramesh Bala has predicted that the worldwide weekend box office collection of the film will cross around 540 crore leaving Amir Khan's Dangal way behind. Bala also shared the revenue earned by the Hindi version of the film, which incidentally is already in the 100 crore league. Going by his figures, the Hindi version of Bahubali 2 earned 42 crore on 28th April and the number rose to 42 and 46 crore on 29th and 30th respectively. This takes the film's Hindi revenue to 129 crore at the end of day 3 and wow! Yet another deal left for the long weekend to go by. Most cinemas are seen having houseful bots and does make us wonder how the day will end for this magnum opus which has created history in Indian cinema. What do you think? Let us know by commenting in the section below. <laughs> इसके चलते फिल्म इंडस्ट्री को काफी क्रिटिसिज्म भी झेलना पड़ रहा है कि इसलिए क्योंकि आज के आज के जनरेशन के जो कलाकार हैं वो उनके अंतिम दर्शन के लिए जी गए थे तो इस 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 सिलसिले में आप कुछ कहना चाहेंगे देखिए दिस इज वेरी सैड न्यूज़ मैं भी बहुत बड़ी फैन हूँ विनोद खन्ना जी की लेक आने देना चाहिए एक्चुअली क्योंकि हम उनके फैन रह चुके हैं ही वाज अ ग्रेट हीरो लेजेंड ऑफ़ द फिल्म इंडस्ट्री तो आई डोंट नो ऐसा क्यों किया है विन फ्यूचर गॉड ना करे और भी बड़े-बड़े सेलिब्रिटीज़ हैं तो हर आर्टिस्ट को आने देना चाहिए कहाँ ये जा रहा था कोई बड़ी पार्टीज़ होती हैं तो चले जाते ह I have to say that 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 but every artist should go to the show. Maybe if there is a shooting, then it is not possible. Sorry. Nirishi Kapoor has an official statement that the artists are going to go to the parties. Yes, this is also with Nirishi Kapoor Ji. People are going to go to the party. They 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 are going to go to the party. But if there is a funeral, why do they go to the party? This is wrong. If there is a funeral or a big legend, then they should go. Why do they go? I am going to go to the party. पहुंच जाती हूँ, लेकिन मैं तो ऐसे पहुंच जाती हूँ, because वहाँ पे तो without makeup जाना होता है ना, तो मुझे लोग पहचानते नहीं हैं वहाँ पे, इसलिए without makeup, तो media को पता ही नहीं चलता राखी आई कि नहीं आई, sir. Thank you. Well, Vinod ji बहुत ही बेहतरीन कलाकार थे, he was one of the best actors we had. और उनके साथ जब मैंने काम किया तो मैं बहुत ही नई थी और बहुत ही छोटी थी तो मैं उनको हमेशा ऑब्जर्व करती थी और उनकी एक फिल्म थी जो बहुत मतलब इट वाज ऑन अ कमर्शियल मूवी लेकिन अचानक एक फिल्म थी उनकी उसमें बहुत ही बेहतरीन काम किया था लाकर एक 
बहुत ही अच्छी थी तो हम सब जनरेशन हमारी जो है दिस अ लॉट वी गुड लर्न फ्रॉम हिम और इट्स वेरी सैड वी हैव टू शो स्टार्ट The wedding of Nepali's businessman and industrialist Binod Chaudhary's son Varun and jewellery Rajkumar Tongia's daughter Anushri was a star-studded affair, which was attended by a host of celebrities including Salman Khan, fashion designer J J Balia, actor turned politician Shatrughan Sinha, Rajni Khan's wife Lata, the ex-P of Bangladesh Hussain Muhammad Arshad. Sri Lankan PM Ranil Wickremesinghe and other eminent politicians and big wigs from across the globe. High profile guests were ferried from boats designed like shikaras and the venue was straight out of a fairy tale. Celeb chef Ritu Dalmia dished out some finger licking delicacies while Prem Kushwaha's lilting voice created a dreamy and peaceful aura. While we await pictures from the venue to let us know what you think of this elite guest list. Excuse me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excuse me. Can the question be only? Because I was doing my work that point of time, I was shooting a video which will come very soon, somewhere abroad. I will not disclose the location yet. Yeah. So that time I was uh, shooting for my own video with a very good artist. It's coming soon. So uh, yeah, that's why. I had a beautiful collaboration with Mahesh sir. Um, I've worked before Mahesh sir for uh, the other movie Rubik's Cube. and it was a very entertaining and energetic song i loved it uh, again vishal's composition and uh, he does such a great job i really love all his uh, songs and uh, mahesh sir has a great taste in music he knows how to pick the best songs so i'm happy that i'm part of this project uh, the second uh, marathi movie of uh, mahesh manjrekar so i'm i'm very blessed and happy Though news of Salman Khan and Kabir Khan being at loggerheads is still doing the rounds, it seems that the two share a mutual respect and admiration for each other. This time on their third venture together is already creating ripples way before the release date. Having created magic with Ekta Tiger and Bajrangi Bhai Jaan, Salman and Kabir Khan are all set to showcase their skills once more in the Indo-China war based cross-border love story Tube Light. Speaking about Salman and his acting, filmmaker Kabir Khan revealed that Salman has brought so much soul in Tube Light that every movie lover is going to cry in the theater. Wow. That's quite a potent thing to say. Don't you think so? Tube Light is all set to create wonders this Eid, so are you ready for it? Do let us know by commenting in the section below. Raika, a small fan of Salman Khan in Australia, recently celebrated her birthday with her favorite star. Salman as we know is busy with wrapping up the shoot of Tiger Zinda Hai and was also in Australia for his The Bang tour. So when he heard about Raika a small fan obviously he catered to her need of celebrating her birthday he accepted it We have seen Salu catering to the needs of his fans especially when it is a child fan Haven't we seen her born with her Shali Malhotra as Munni in Bajrangi Bhaijaan and then there was Suzy who cried after watching Salman in Bajrangi Bhaijaan who was again attended to by Salman Raika a small fan in Australia also got the same attention from Bhai Chan and here are some pictures which you surely would love what do you feel about Raika's quotient with her icon do let us know Vinod Khanna fondly called VK was an enigmatic yet friendly artist whose death has filled our hearts with grief. His charisma was very evident every time he faced the camera. Even when he played character roles, his aura matched those of superstars like Salman Khan and Shah Rukh Khan. Let us take the instance of the SRK star of Dilwale where Vinod played a formidable gangster and father of Shah Rukh. The film may not have worked wonders, but Vinod Khanna's presence shone like never before in the limited scenes. Mm-hmm. 
Meanwhile, here we found a deleted scene from the film which clearly reveals the swag the star had despite his age. The set scene shows Shah Rukh battling the rival gang when he is about to be hit badly. It was then that Dad Vinod enters in style and then takes on the goons scaring them away. As the world mourns the death of the legendary star Vinod Khanna, it is difficult to believe that he is no more. Meanwhile, take a look at this deleted scene and let us know your take on this legacy left behind by the mega star.